Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on February 27th, 2023. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to a space weather update. Having a look here at our magnetosphere as we were being pounded last night by solar winds over 600 kilometers per second, upwards of 700 kilometers per second. Difference between solar winds and the pressure planes here. There was an immense amount of pressure on our planet last night, and it continued on today. This is a look at our density. Cut planes as we had that CME impact last night and into today. And look at this as we bumped right up to over 868 kilometers per second. Earth is being bombarded right now by a coronal mass ejection. And that is from that M-class solar flare that we had just about two days ago. Shared here with daily events worldwide. I wanted to share with you the magnetosphere and how it looks when it's being pounded by 800 kilometer per second solar winds. Amazing stuff. This all started about three hours ago. And as I said, it topped out at 868 kilometers per second. Only a couple times in my five years of documenting and sharing information here with daily events worldwide have I seen it upwards over 1,000 kilometers per second. I've seen it at 1,200 kilometers per second. But it has not been this prevalent for quite some time. That was from our double Earth-facing M-class solar flares, northeast region of our sun. If you haven't seen the update video, please check it out. Amazing images. Solar Dynamics Observatory. The pressure is on, folks. I'm going to try to share as much information here as I can with what I know right now. Solar X-ray flux remains in the C range right now. No new major solar flares to talk about. But look at the KP index as it hopped up to a strong 7. DRAP absorption map here, looking at the highest frequency affected by the cosmic energy. Africa got zapped last night, northern and southern hemisphere, both poles getting rocked. As well as South America early this morning. Having a look here at our aurora forecast for North Pole and South Pole. Strong G3 geomagnetic storm tonight. So eyes to the skies across Canada and as well more northern United States all across Russia and into parts of Eastern Europe. Huge cosmic radiation storm. Having a look at the real-time solar wind Right now, we are at about 815 kilometers per second. But last night, we were around 700 kilometers per second. And it was slowly ramping up just before the update. And then it dropped down to about 480. And then early this morning, hopped right up to 821 kilometers per second. Doubled the solar wind speeds. Topping out, as I said, 868 kilometers per second. Amazing times to be alive. Here's a look at new CME. No new CMEs heading our way, but we are still expecting the second impact here from the double impact CME. If you haven't seen the video yet, please check it out. I'm gonna leave you here looking at Lasco 3 and that large CME, Halo CME blast ripping from our sun. Much love. Stay safe out there, stay healthy, aware and prepared. Bye-bye now. Enjoyed today's
today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.